Okay. We'll keep moving. We can get to the mansion later. It's not something that's a huge worry of mine yet. Let's check our skills. Uh, we have 71% and one in driving skill so far. Uh, okay, no other town. Usually like to, like to raid the outermost areas of towns. Anything up here, I wonder? Medical, plutonium, packed M72 law, which means I am going there. There's no other stuff around, well, no other animals or anything around, actually. Zombie, apparently. Packed M72 law. It's the thing I'm after because it can save me in difficult situations. Let's see, uh, where's the other one? Inside there. Let's just try and get it before the zombies notice me. Okay, so now we have the uh, packed M72 laws. Let's drop them in here. Get our, move our way around. Apparently the windshield's broken. I think it's the same one, maybe. I'm gonna go check that parking lot. If there's a flatbed truck, I'm most likely gonna switch out this vehicle for that. Is that a parking lot? Yeah, the, it's a uh, something or other. Actually, I could just clear out this FEMA camp. It's actually not too hard, considering I have a vehicle. Let's just slow down and run around in circles. Usually kills zombies after a while. See? Most are dead. Now we just need to wait for the others to arrive. Until I start taking damage, which I hopefully won't. If I do, uh, I'll be the enemy. <laughs> no, I won't. I'll just take some damage. Come on. There are still zombie soldiers. Okay. I think we're good. Come on, the rest of you. Uh, this huge treatment plant can contain a powered welder, I think, because um, it's, well, it's a huge treatment plant. It has to have some sort of equipment. Let's back up. Okay. Come on. Okay. And we're still waiting for the zombie soldiers to arrive. There actually is a flatbed truck here. Hmm. I think I'm actually going to get it, as I said. Because FEMA camps actually contain uh, a lot of crates, which I've shown in a previous episode. And, well, crates are usually fairly good to open, pry open. But I have a morning star, so I can actually bash them open. That's the wrong way. Come on. I'm not going to go into the FEMA camp yet. Until I've killed most of the zombies off. I was trying to destroy the crate, that's why it's not be. That's why it's not able to come through, because smashing a fence is apparently a lot easier than smashing a crate. But I got them loose, pretty much. Okay. And... Will he die? There we go. Okay, let's move up a bit, and come to a halt. Go out of the vehicle. And go check out this huge treatment plant. But the thing is, I don't actually have access to the place because I'm really shitty with a computer. Because I haven't read any books yet. On the, the subject of computers. It's a cougar. Do they contain anything? Not really. Oh, a wrench! Where is it? There it is. Wrench. Let's go smash this thing with a morning star. Come on. 
just leapt over the chain link fence. Come on. Okay. Climb it and open this. Anything in here? A uh, can of root beer. There's usually nothing in these crates in these places. But there can be some stuff just lying all around. No, nothing here. That's a burial place. Can be stuff on this desk. Ah, uh, that's a zombie soldier. I don't like those. They can be fairly hard to kill. Is this reinforced glass? It is. Come on. I even... Oh, he hit my eye. Okay, critical hit him. Uh, come on, die! There we go, it's dead. I can't really fight more than one of those at a time. Oh shit. It's a web spider. It's usually very bad to fight. I've ended many a game against spiders and ants. Not really ants, but spiders. Oh shit, it's open. So of course there's going to be a zombie there. But he's usually easy to kill. Let's see, ski pants. It's a lot easier to destroy these with a morning star rather than a crowbar. Oh, we don't really destroy them with a crowbar now, do we? But we can usually smash it because of the bash rating of it. Uh, let's just pick up all the nails. I'm going to take the winter coat. Come on. Smash, 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 smash. And there we go. Pick up the nails, nails, nails. Even more of them. There's nothing in these crates, okay. Nothing in these either, by the looks of it. Okay. Pick up the nail. Nail again. Just a bunch of nails. I think all these desks, eyeglasses. Nothing there. Flashlight. I'm going to take it. Ah, uh, the can be weapons in here. M4A1 charge rifle. Wow, there are actually a lot of weapons. A lot more than I'm used to seeing. Let's claim, climb that. There's a dog after us. Not too worried about dogs. I really wanted to find a powered welder. But I'm not lucky enough. Let us Drop some stuff like the uh, weapons, the nails, the wrench, the flashlight, the winter coat. Let's go kill that dog. There. And let's start picking up stuff. There, and some more stuff here. Okay, that's too heavy. Actually, it's not too heavy, is it? I'm overburdened, of course. But it's, it's going to be exhausting to carry it for ages, though. But I'm guessing he, well, he doesn't really have to do that. Let's see, plastic bottle, aluminium can. Okay. Takes a while to transfer stuff. But it's usually worth it. FG, HI. 
J-K-L-M-N-O. Okay, that's too much. I should have maybe moved it closer, but it doesn't really matter. There, there. No, come on. There we go. There. Okay, and that. So much stuff. I'm a hoarder. That. Come on. There. Wow, I've actually gathered a lot of stuff. And a lot of it's actually food and water. <laughs> Let's drink some of it. There. 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 Some more. Just drink all the cola. Okay. And eat your broccoli. Your apple. That's about what I have of food from what I picked up. Uh, aluminium cans, still chain. There was nothing more, yeah. Okay, let us start moving with our flatbed truck then. Uh, it has doesn't hasn't have hasn't got a lot of fuel. So I'm going to make my way straight south and see if I can find anything of interest. Possibly a town containing a garage or something. Maybe a military surplus station or a pawn shop. And still be able to actually do stuff. That would be nice. Who knows, maybe I'll be able to do it. This place doesn't actually contain a garage, as far as I can see. I could do a... just run in there and get it. Then run away again. Let's take some aspirin. In pairs. So we're hitting a road. I'm gonna go inside the town. Just for a bit. The good thing about actually having a lot of vehicles is you can just disassemble them and, well, go and fix up another car if you want to. You can even make another car if you just disassemble it and get your steel frame out. Where you can just build up the car later on. It's actually quite a nice. That's a garage, isn't it? No, it's a parking lot. Uh, that's a park. There should be child zombies in there. Unless there isn't. There are. Uh, more parks. Come on. There we go. Let's turn here. Because there are a lot of zombies here, apparently. I don't really want to go into smoke. That's a grocery store. That's a pawn shop, but I can't really go in there. I haven't got the means to. I could use my uh, packed amylores, but that wouldn't do much. If I had like 10 goo canisters, I could try and wipe out half of them. If I really wanted to do it with a flatbed truck, I could, but I really don't want to risk dying. I really want to have a character that is able to survive, learns a lot of skills, and eventually just is awesome. He's still fumbling with the controls, even though he's three in driving. It's kind of strange. One cylinder engine, yeah, right. I'm not going to grab that. Let's keep moving. What if there's anything interesting on this road? I'm hoping a town. Or just a powered welder lying around. Oh, that would also be nice. Look at how far I can drive straight. It's amazing. Oh, he started to fumble again. Oh, another parking lot. I think I've been here. Maybe. We'll see. There's a powered welder. I'm going to be a happy camper. 
There's probably not going to be one. Anything on these counters? No. Come on, stop saving. Boots and a rubber hose. Actually, I'm going to go and try and hack this. I managed to do it. Okay, so let's go downstairs. <clears throat> what are these sewage pipes? Do I have a flashlight? I do in my little truck up there. I think, unless I left it back in the base. Let's see. No, there. There we go. Flashlight. Do I have batteries? Not really. Oh, whatever. Do these have drapes? No. Okay, let's turn on our flashlight and head downstairs. Uh, another wrench. I don't really need another one. These guys have had fun. Well, there's dope everywhere. Not really everywhere, but some. Uh, hard hat, boots. I could just rummage through the sewers. Let me see. Download sewer map. Divert sample. Hack. How much do it? Sewage sample. Wow. Can't pick up a fluid. Do I have plastic bottles? I have them upstairs. Maybe I should get some. I am going to as soon as I've dis uh, explored this place a bit. More? It's a playboy. Let's see, so the sewer maps. There's a note there. Goes up. Goes up. Those are automatic notes, by the way. Uh, that the game places whenever it finds a place that goes up, so you'll be able to more easily go outside again. Now, I should have a bunch of stuff. Not really a bunch of stuff, but a bunch of, for example, aluminum cans lying around. Uh, where are my... There's more stuff there. Ooh, cool. Didn't know I had this. Uh, aluminum can. I should have a bunch of empty bottles. There we go, plastic bottle. The aluminum cans don't actually have a lid. So let's just drop them. Uh, now that I think about it, let's take this and a then pick it up. Uh, water and some food. Let's eat our ravioli. Let's drink our water. Okay. So we're slaked. We're not full anymore. We, we were just full. And it decided to not let us be that anymore. Ooh, there's actually a door there. Oh, it leads to the outside. Cool. Uh, his morale has probably dropped. Yeah, he's wet. No one likes being wet. Who likes being wet? Let's see. And samples. Come on. Oops. Sewage sample. You can't pick up a liquid. Uh, let's apply. Plastic bottle. Apply. Apply. As no, can't pick up a liquid. Do I need glass flask or something? Do I that sample? Hack into system. It's huge leaks. It's a lot of sewage samples. Uh, plastic bottle of water. Stuff of life, the best. What? That's sewage. No. I can't pick it up. Oh well. 
Doesn't really matter. Just want to see what it was. Maybe I could have analyzed it. Okay, so let us check our skill with computers. 51%. And our mechanics is as good as well. Okay. So we have a wrench, but we still need a powered welder. I can change tires, that's for sure. I can't really do anything else. Which is kind of boring, if you ask me. Okay, let's go down this road for a bit. I can sleep in the car, but that would be silly. I could just go back to the sewage treatment plant and sleep there. Yeah, I think I could. Don't go close to that. Uh, 5.25 p.m. My guy's cold. Where's he cold? Cold arms. Do I have... Yes, I do have a peacoat. Good. I don't know what a peacoat is, but... I'm sure it's sort of warm. Maybe? What is a peacoat? A heavy cotton coat. <laughs> yeah. It's very warm, actually. Up and down this road. See? Dead squirrels. Move faster. More speed. Uh, fumble with the controls. Okay, how's this? Yeah, it should be reaching rank 4 soon in driving. Cool. Now this is a place where I can actually do some stuff. I think I've actually been there, maybe. There we go, it's that. Oh, no, 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 no. There's another jumping spider. I'm crying out loud. These things are everywhere. Oop. Move around, kill the wolves. Okay, and turn around to kill that wolf. There we go. Okay, so let's see if we can find a powered welder or something. I know there are a bunch of zombies in the bar. Oh, I've been here. Cool. Maybe this shovel. You can tell where I've been. Everything's destroyed. In there, no, I've already raided everything, I think. Mm, well, there's a bunch of stuff here. I wonder what I died with this character. Can't really tell. Hmm. Huh. Smash, smash, smash. Can't pick up hay either. Okay, so this farm is pretty much not something I want to be in. Alright. Let's make our way over to our f base. Shouldn't be too hard. You could just cut across the plains. Not really plains, but plain ish. Just hope there's no forest. Oh, there's actually a road down south. That's going to help. As long as I don't drive into the forest. 6.24 p.m. after all. Come on. More speed. You're an excellent driver now, I think. Yeah, 93%. Up to four ranks. How the frick can someone with... Oh, 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 stop, 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 stop. If you see mounds like this, divert. Because those are landmines. Uh, is that a wood axe area? I think there's wood axes there, yeah. I don't need a wood axe. I think. If I need one, I'll just find one. It's not really all that hard to find. I could just mark it, like, wood axe. Yeah, if I ever need it, I'll just go pick it up. Simple as that. 
I think this road will lead me to my mansion. Look at my driving skills, I'm amazed. I find it very fun to be able to drive this well with a character that's never really driven before. You can tell by him swerving around all the time. But every, pretty much everyone knows the basic mechanics of driving. I hope, at least. Let's see. Still a 97%. It does take a while, the last few. I just like killing wolf spiders because they're annoying and I don't think I'll meet them again at a later date so I'm just pretty much making myself sure that there are fewer of them in the world. Also kill bears. Pick up speed. Okay so there's a forest in the way. Let's go down south. Uh, yeah, we're good. There's more landmines there. Good to know, good to know. More speed. I need to get away from those spiders. More speed. You can actually have a lot of speed in this. Ooh, slow down for the corner. It's a 90 degree turn after all. Oh right, these people. Uh, they don't actually have anything of interest. I need to turn around and kill some stuff. No, oh, there's nothing actually to kill. I guess that's good. A little disappointing, but good. There's a cougar, but I can kill a cougar. Oh, there's a jumping spider. Ooh, there's a wolf spider as well. Uh, let us go inside again. Turn around. Dead. And dead, and there's another one. Where is it? There it is. It's dead. It's another jumping spider. Jesus Christ, they're everywhere. Look, two of them even. I really want to go into the Swedish treatment plant without actually being killed by spiders. There's one more. Okay. Let's exit. Close. Now the cougar is going to try and kill me. It's kind of funny. I am going to go in here and try and hack the computer. And it didn't work. It just locked me out. That's what you do with security. You lock out people that try to do stuff against... Well, with your stuff. Let's see. Uh, headlights. No, that's not it. That's not it. That's it. You usually want headlights when you drive during the night. Good thing I have sort of a map of where I'm going. But you need headlights to be able to actually see anything. Because if you don't have that, you'll pretty much be fucked. I don't think this thing has headlights. It does. So we're good. I'm almost at the mansion. This thing is actually too big to park in the mansion, I think, but I can't really park it because I can't see anything when I'm backing up. Okay, so here we are, back at the base. Ah, uh, no, I don't want to move the... Okay, that but, Oh, shh. Why does he launch out? I forgot to turn off the headlights. I really need to turn them off. Ah, uh, that... Because it drains the battery. I think there's a battery. It would make sense. Let's turn on a flashlight. The batteries are dead. Do I actually have any batteries with me? Yeah, I do. Uh, inventory, flashlight, reload. No, that's not it. Uh, flashlight, reload. Apply, flashlight, and go inside. Close. And then you turn off the flashlight and you sleep. Ah, 
It didn't. It wasn't able to sleep. Let's pick up. I have sleeping pills with me, don't I? I do. Okay, sleep. He's able to sleep for quite a while now, it seems. There we go. We're good. All right. So this is going to be this for this session, at least. It's going to be a. Lo it was a long one for me. Ah uh, well. See you around next time. Thanks for watching.